So, uh, it's me, your little boy, Kishamsen. So, I have this message to give us how to identify that you are choosing. You know, in most cases, the truth is this not everyone is called a choosing, not everyone is what is selected. So, there are many things that make you or that qualify you as a choosing. Yes, you know, when I was at home, some of my friends used to tell me, Samson, many people choose themselves, many people call themselves. Not everyone who said they are, they are these, are these, hear the voice of God. Many people are being called by what? By themselves, not by God. So, you know, how to identify that you are choosing is one, you always feel like helping others. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You always have that urge. That spirit always comes to you helping others even if other people have hurt you take advantage of you and sometimes you feel like turning back but that spirit always move you to help others and another thing you always feel what pain of others you always feel pain of others you always feel like ah I wish I can have something to help them. I wish I can be in that position to help them. I wish I can be in that position where I can be able to do or to assist them, help them, you know, help them to overcome these trials. And sometimes the only the things that will make you to identify you are choosing is that whenever you encounter problem, you always have mist of escape. And, and another thing is that people always talk bad of you. No matter how good you are to them, they, they always end up be, turn, talking bad of you. Sometimes they will turn your, your goodness to become whatever. And sometimes many of them whom you do good to, they will never, never do what be, be grateful to you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And another thing that will make you to understand that you are indeed a choosing is that you always have a dream where you are moving above the, or the earth level. <laughs> and sometimes you dream where you are in, maybe bathing in the dream, you know, or washing hand in a dream, or maybe driving, or maybe flying. You know what I'm saying? All this stuff. Or maybe sometimes you see yourself in a crowd where place, you know, praising, praising God, giving thanks to God. So all these things are the signs that you used to under, identify that indeed you are a choosing. Because many people who will be telling you, I'm a choosing, I'm this, many of them are not choosing. The reason why they are pretending, acting like they are choosing is because they love to be, but they are not yet called. He said, many are the source of God, but the Spirit of God will tell of whom they are. He said, time will come when many will be saying, I am the Lord. Here is God. Here. He said, but I know them by my fruit. By their fruit we shall do what know them. So the real truth is this. Not everyone is, is what is a choosing. But everyone can become a choosing. But not everyone is a choosing. That's why Christ said, he, he said to them, he said, yes, many will call me, but I will say to them, I know them not. So, you being a choosing, that odd that always put Christ to have compassion on others, we always have it. it you know, when someone tells you a, 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 he or she is a, a choosing, try to figure out does that does she have that or that urge that book that push christ to have compassion on others because there are many places where christ have compassion on others there are many places where the chosen ones have compassion if you read a lot the the story of david joseph anna so you got to understand so what type of urge do you have what is that thing that always pushed you yes the word choosing is very very what polite and good light because once you are selected you are no longer in the world but you are in the world <laughs> you know what I'm saying? so what does that mean is that when you know, another thing you used to identify that you are choosing is that whenever you have problem or whenever maybe you involve in downfall, maybe something happened, you lost some certain things, you always bounce by overnight. You always stand up overnight whenever you fall back. Because the Bible says, 
the, the Bible says, even if I fall, I will still rise again. So as a choosing, there are many signs. Whenever you fall, before people who are laughing, you finished laughing, you have already what backs by to even more better than where you do used to be, even higher than where you do used to. So these are the signs that you used to identify that you are choosing. You know what I'm saying? Don't let people tell you that as long as you are choosing, you will never fall. No, you may fall, but you will never remain there. You know what I'm saying? So these are the things that qualified you as a choosing. You know what I'm saying? So remember, blessed me, God blessed you.